Wrestle Dude. The Wrestle Dude. The Wrestle Dude. Hello everybody and welcome back to the Rust Dude channel is here today. We have some exciting news about WWE 2K19 and some current roster inclusions and also some speculation on roster inclusions due to the crowd. That's what we're going to talk about today and here we go. So at NXT UK's taping over in Birmingham uh, as a part of the gaming uh I guess, uh, festival that was going on. I, I believe it's called Insomniac or Somni, Insomni, uh, something like that. Uh, I heard that Xavier Woods won a trophy there for the most subscribed celebrity gaming channel. So some, so some, some, I'm going to keep that in. I'm going to keep that in because it's important that you guys know that even YouTubers make mistakes, um, but congratulations to Up Up Down Down is what I wanted to say. Congratulations to them. Uh, but at this uh, event, there was a reveal of two new superstars that are going to be coming to WWE 2K19 in the form of NXT UK Champion. Pete Dunne and one half of Mustache Mountain, Tyler Bate, and we not only got some great screenshots for it and confirmation of it, we got entrances, and these entrances looked great, and this is a big turning point for me, but uh, I'm going to break down everything, so they gave us uh, en both entrances, Pete Dunne with the United Kingdom Championship uh, in his teeth, everything, he had the jacket on, it looked great, uh, the Titan Tron looked great, uh, it confirms that we had the NXT arena, and also a t-shirt in the crowd confirms that we have what I believe was NXT TakeOver New Orleans. Orleans arena so we'll have that which is very good it's good to have more and more arenas uh, and confirmations of such and um, we actually have a little bit to talk about here in the form of some more roster inclusions uh, obviously to point out uh, since Tyler Bate is going to be in the game uh, that's obviously one half of Mustache Mountain which would all in all confirm that Trent Seven is also going to be in the game it would make no sense to have Tyler Bateman, no Trent Seven, and now we have British Strong Style. Um, some more uh, t-shirts that were in the crowd. I'll go through the ones that belong to superstars that are already in the game or have already been in games. So we have, um, I spotted a We Are NXT t-shirt, which is a pretty easy guess that that would be in the game. Um, considering these entrances were taking place in the NXT arena. Uh, also, in the crowd, we could see a newly updated Roderick Strong t-shirt. We could see a Johnny Gargano, Johnny Wrestling t-shirt. We saw an Aleister Black uh, t-shirt. And there were a couple other ones. There was also a Bruiserweight uh, shirt. There was one that... It was the one that I was trying to look at so close, and I went on to WWEshop.com to see which one fit the bill the most, and it seemed to be uh, Pete Dunne's own shirt. So those belong to WWE superstars that have already been in games, or we could already assume we're going to be in the games in the form of Trent Seven. But now these are some of the crowd t-shirts that are basically confirming new superstars that are going to be in the game, with the first being the t-shirt. Um, this was probably the most noticeable one, just because there were a lot of uh, crowd people wearing them and that's for the former NXT Women's Champion the Queen of Spades Shayna Baszler her t-shirt uh, was included uh, also we have one of my favorite groups in WWE right now Da -da 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 -da. it is the Undisputed Era so that confirms Kyle O'Reilly Bobby Fish and Adam Cole, baby. Uh, so those are three great inclusions right there. Shayna Baszler is an excellent con inclusion. Tyler Bate and Pete Dunn are excellent conclu inclusions. Trent Seven is obviously a great con inclusion, but it doesn't stop there. We also have a t-shirt confirming the Velveteen Dreams. So if you guys didn't know already, I did a video a while back predicting which NXT superstars were going to be in this year's game, and you can uh, check that out in a card. I'll put it up in the corner. There's also going to be a poll there uh, asking you what you guys think of Tyler Bate and Pete Dunne being included in the game. It will be a yes or no type of question. 
Um, but yeah, so we have Shayna Baszler, Roderick Strong, Jenna Gargano, Undisputed Era. So that's three guys, Adam Cole, Kyle O'Reilly, and Bobby Fish, Alistair Black, Velveteen Dream, Trent Seven, and it also, a t-shirt, like I said, confirms the arena for NXT TakeOver New Orleans. So a lot of confirmations there in the NXT realm. All in all... I'd say this was some pretty good news drop today, and I feel like it's going to keep continuing. I just wanted to get this video out so you guys could hear my thoughts on it. And also something uh, that I want to put in here, uh, I posed the question to this, does it make me want to buy the game? Uh, that has been a trending question here for me doing these videos on WWE 2K19, whether or not I want to buy the game. And I told them that they're going to have to give me some stuff to really sink my teeth into. And... They gave me something uh, recently with a Ronda Rousey screenshot that I thought looked great. It looked awesome. And now they've given me, if you guys don't know, I'm a huge fan of NXT. So giving me confirmation of all these NXT superstars is amazing. You guys know how much I love NXT. I do the NXT TakeOver review shows. I have my own universe mode based around NXT. So this is great. This is a really big step in the right direction. In the beginning, I was starting to hate WWE 2K19 just because they had that bland AJ Styles um, screenshot. They didn't really give us a lot of details. The Daniel Bryan showcase mode was a definite yes. So there was one thing that I didn't like about it. And then there was the Daniel Bryan showcase thing, which I was a little optimistic on, but for the most part, I liked the Shayna or the Ronda Rousey screenshot I thought looked great. And then we had NXT stars confirmed for this. So, so far it's one thing compared to three things that I like. So the, the odds are in 2K19's favor, but one of the big things that I'm gonna be looking out for is just how do I think I would enjoy this game? Is it a game that I'm going to be able to pick up and play anytime I want? Or is it a game that would really only benefit the universe mode series and maybe a couple videos here and there? Is it a game that I could play anytime and enjoy? Or is it a game that I can only play when it's benefits me making content so um that's gonna still be a big question for me uh for now i think this is really good i think this is a good step in the right direct direction um pete dunn and tyler beta two big nxt uk stars among with all the others that are basically confirmed through these t-shirts um but yeah, I thought this was great. If you guys would like to watch the entrances, I do not own the footage. I have no right to be showing that footage on my channel. So I will link uh, a video so you guys can watch the entrances. It'll be the top comment in the comment section so you guys can watch it there. But that has been it from me, the Wrestle Dude Jacob, uh, just talking about some NXT stars confirmed for WWE 2K19 and my opinion on whether or not this has pushed me any further into buying the game, which it sort of has. Uh, but thank you guys for watching the video. You can follow me on social media at the Wrestle Dude on Twitter. Uh, it'll be linked in the video description. You can also check out our website and among other things. But above all else, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a thumbs up for the video and leave me your thoughts. What other NXT superstars do you want to see in WWE 2K19? Thank you for joining me, and I will see you guys next time.